Today I will be reviewing the Kingdom Hearts Play Arts Halloween Town Sora. I'm gonna start out with the appearance. On the appearance they did really good. They got the little points on his shoes. They got the socks. They have the little pointy fingers. He has the pumpkin on his head. And in the back he has his little wings and his wimpy little cape. And he has the little crosses on his hands. And he has that little crown up there on his chest. Overall, he has a really good appearance. Time for the articulation. His head is on a ball joint, but it can't move much because of his collar. It kind of prevents it from moving, so that's kind of a downfall. But anyway, pretty good. His arm can move up and down. It can move like that. It can also twist right there up at the top by his shoulder and his elbow can move and his hand can move sideways. His stomach can move in the middle like that like most Kingdom Hearts figures can and then his legs can move like that like that and they can move a little bit like that. His knee, his knee joint can move like that. Not very much, but it can move. And his feet have a lot of articulation. They can move like that. They can move up and down. They can move um, sideways, actually, also. So, overall, he has pretty good articulation, too. This figure does come with a stand. He has the little clip in his hand to hold the keyblade. This is his keyblade. The keyblade is made of very flimsy plastic, so just be careful with it, because it's probably really easy to break. The keyblade has the hole to clip into his hand so that he can hold it pretty good. His keyblade has a little skeleton right there, just like in the game. And the key part is a bat, again, just like in the game. And just like Mickey's Keyblade, it is a real chain, and it can come off. And he has a little pumpkin for his keychain. I don't know if this changes you wanting to buy him or not, but he can't hold his Keyblade worth of crap. It just always falls off, no matter how you make him hold it. If you make him hold it like this, like it's supposed to, it won't work. But a lot of reviews and stuff say that you should make him hold it like that. It holds it better, but it still falls off pretty dang easy. So it's not very good. But he's still a pretty good figure. So just watch out for that if you're planning on buying him. You can get him for $25 at a Toys R Us. I would recommend buying this figure, but not for over $30 because of that little Keyblade thing.